the next uh, company. Uh, I've been part of the Capital Innovation uh, training process last year. It's one of the most uh, spectacular, or maybe visual, uh, uh, innovation that we got uh, lately, so in Montreal. So I'm uh, very pleased to introduce you to Merck Law. Hi, my name is Alan Jones and I'm CEO of Merchler, which is a mobile music community. And today I'm going to show you how to create your very own app if you're an artist in under five minutes. So here's the ecosystem filled with, populated with artist apps. So let's go to add artist. Let's say we want to add the artist Empire Isaacs. Type in her name. It searches the database. And we found it right here. So we're going to click on that. We're going to choose a banner that's suitable for her. Press agree. Save. And now we have her bio that's over here, her banner that's up there. And what we're going to do is we're going to connect accounts. So let's connect accounts here. Within two minutes, all of Empire Isis albums are here. And you can listen to them or you can buy them. Now let's go to our YouTube account. And here you have her parties, her music videos, uh, everything. We can also go to her feeds. So everything related to Empire Isis here in her music feeds. We can go to Augmented Reality here. And now all her things here, her t-shirts, her albums, her posters, are now associated with whatever content that she wants to put on. As soon as it sees a CD, it plays a music video. Let's play that again. And as you can see here, it is extremely stable. Okay, I showed you guys now the video stuff, now I'm going to show you guys the 3D stuff. So, Merchler, well, what does that mean where does it come from? I've been a record producer in the music industry for the last 10 years. And when I was producing the last, my last uh, album, I thought to myself, what am I going to do so people care about this physical product that no one seems to be buying anymore, right? So I looked into different technologies, and I saw one that I thought was really great. Well, I thought I saw augmented reality. So I got together with some developers, and we created at the time the world's first augmented reality app for an artist. We released it, it did super well. Thousands of downloads, the artists went from obscurity to well-known. And um, then after that, my distributors, Universal, said to me, um, well, can you create this for every artist in the world? Great idea. Great, great idea. And that's really how the company was formed. So, what is the major problem in the music industry right now? Well, actually, everyone in this room already knows that, and that's declining record sales, right? People don't buy CDs anymore, so less and less money each and every single year. So there's two main sources for these seven million artists that are out there, right? And that's live shows and, of course, merchandise. But merchandise has not changed in the last 50 years. It's the exact same thing, right? You take some sort of cool logo or whatever, you put on a t-shirt, and then after that you sell it to your fan base. But how many t-shirts could you possibly sell? Not very many, especially if you're among that 99% that is not on a major record label. So, artists need to do two things. Increase their merchandise sales, and they need a platform to do that. Now, what you guys saw before was the actual platform. And it's basically any artist can go and create their app in five minutes. And it's free, and you can add augmented reality. And all of a sudden, you now have a platform where <clears throat> interactive merchandise becomes attractive. You now are selling, you're now selling something that people actually want. <clears throat> when, I start, when, I, when I started out and I built this platform, um, you know, I said I was going to do it in nine months. I'm young, I'm arrogant, and I thought I could really, really do it. Even Martin over here told me, Awen, if it's nine months, make it 12 or you know, 16 months. I was like, no, 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 I'm going to do it in nine months. So, <clears throat> of course, development comes in, and month, around month eight, I go and I hire my sales and my marketing guys, right? So I hire them, and guess what happens at month nine? Platform's not ready. So what do I do? 
well, you can adapt or die, right? So I go, I, I tell my sales and my marketing guys, I say, go and see if other people are interested in our technology. Just go out and check it out. And, um, well, they are. Uh, and it's really, and it's an exploding business for us. In the last three months, we've signed, um, well, Ubisoft, uh, partnering up with Sid Lee, uh, Alliance Films, we just did Hunger Games, and we're doing the next eight movies. L I'm going to show you guys what I mean.